Karen, appreciate your time. We've just seen some snippets of that big campaign that's being rolled out today. Just how much yes. convincing do you think Australians will actually need to roll up their sleeves and get the jab? I think there's going to be a range of responses. There's going to be people who will say, heck yes, I want to get my vaccination, line me up. And I think there's going to be a large probably middle group who are going to say, look, I need more information. So I'm really, really pleased to see that we're getting on the front foot with the public health campaign. Um, that, that will be administered, of course, through the media, but also we encourage people to come and see your GPs, your healthcare providers, to actually update yourself uh, and perhaps ask those nuanced questions that you might be uh, having in your mind that you need answered. And what is your message to those people who might fall in some of these categories where the data isn't very clear? I'm thinking the very elderly, pregnant women who might be looking at overseas situations and, and reports and wondering how the vaccine could impact them. Yeah, look, I think it is a very individual um, discussion. So from pre from point of view of pregnant women, we have to weigh the benefits and the risks up, of course. Uh, there is um, a study going on. I think they're collecting data on pregnant women in Israel and the US uh, have got some volunteers who are also getting vaccinated. So we're in some advantageous position in Australia because we're going to get some of that overseas data. The TGA, of course, is our regulatory body and they're going to be looking at this closely. It then goes through another layer of experts from the um, RANSCOG, the Royal Australian College of Obstetricians and Gynecologists, and also our college. And we'll be also uh, looking at that data and, and putting out the advice to our members who will then give it to our patients. So they can be sure that it's gone through a whole level of expertise before we actually give that particular advice regarding pregnant women and breastfeeding women and so forth. So I think um, we are gonna get that good advice and um, people can feel, look, they have to discuss that particular case with their, with their healthcare provider in terms of pregnant women.